Fabrizio Ravanelli to Jaxio side picked up a much needed first win in Ligue 1 this season in midweek with a 2-1 victory over Lyon and that will have helped to ease the pressure before this game against Montpellier. John Fernandez's men have had a frustrating September if consistent they've drawn their last four games in the championship. Well Adrian Mutu was left out of the squad the reason being that he had trained too hard during the week and was too tired to participate. But the game soon swung in Montpellier's favour. Remy Cabela trying to pull across for Suleiman Kamara. And though it looked as though Ajaxio had got the danger clear, there was a straight red card for Claude Goncalves. The 19-year-old judged to have handled the ball there as it came back off Alessandro Castrenzi. So Remy Cabela with the chance to put Montpellier in front, which he did. And the man who was born in Ajaxio has now scored four goals in four games against them. Um, Ochoa getting a hand to it. Well, Ajaxio looking to react here. Ronald Zubar getting that header onto the bar after a ball in from Johan Cavalli. Leaping beautifully there ahead of the Montpellier defence. Unable to get the better of the woodwork. And at the other end, Morgan Sanson denied by Ochoa, the Mexican international goalkeeper. Keeping a safe pair of hands and Paul Lan unleashing this fantastic effort. In the 27th minute, Lan who scored against Evian, of course, a couple of weeks ago. Very, very close to the target there. Fantastic long distance effort. Well, Jaxio did eventually get their equaliser through Zuba after another ball in from Cavalli. Well, he had been completely abandoned by the Montpellier defence. Onside, as you can see here, alongside Sally Marash, the number 21. And Zubat with his first goal for Ajaxio this season. And parity was even restored in terms of the number of players on the pitch. Yassin Jabour shown a second yellow card for this challenge on Stefan Popescu. And given his marching orders, so a goal apiece and a red card apiece at the interval. 1-1 at Stade Francois Coty. The visitors are getting the second half underway. And a chance for captain Vitorino Hilton there at the back post. This time a Choa vigilant. Saving with his shins by the looks of things there. Lan unleashing again from the edge of the area. And a wonderful double save there from Geoffrey Jordan. Kamara with the second attempt after Lam's original shot from the edge of the area. Keeping his side in it and keeping it a 1-1 scoreline. And that was how it finished. Ajaxio and Montpellier sharing the spoils at Francois Coty.